Bruce Brody and Terry Gordy were both on that tour. And uh, Mil Mascaris from Mexico, had a great crew. And and Terry, you know, I, I've never been much of a partier. I just, just, it's just not. Um, when I got into wrestling, my, again, my mindset was, it's a business. I'm going to treat it like a business. I'm a, I got my goals set of, of when I'm uh, going to be out of the business and, and all that. So, so I'm over there, and again, I'm treating it like a business in Japan, just like I am in in in, in the U.S. of A. And um, and and Terry wants to go out one night, and I'm like, all right, all right, yeah, I'll go out with you, dude. And 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 you know, and he had a tendency to, to have a, a, a few too many drinks, um, and he did on that particular night. And, and we we're on the, like the second floor. The, the bars are different over in in Japan, uh, a lot of them. There's like, you know, you got like the main floor, but then there's like a, like a private floor and, diff and different things. So we're up in like the private section or whatever, and, and he just like kind of like, like flips out. I mean, he grabs a fire extinguisher, starts spraying it around, he throws it through through a, a window out the second floor and out to the, and, and he's... <laughs> He start, he's just doing a, a bunch of stuff that was very uh, not good. Um, and I'm like, this is not, this is just not, this is not a good thing. And I, I'm, I was able to finally snatch him and say, dude, we are getting out of here. I mean, I'm starting to hear sirens and I'm like, oh my gosh, this is not, this is not going, this is going south real quick. I get him out of there. We we get back to I get, somehow get back to the hotel, and um, which is uh, interesting in itself how we managed to do that. But we did, and we get back to the hotel. I go to my room. He goes to his. I get him in his room. I get him to bed. You know, and I go to my room. Well, seven o'clock next morning. You know, I I hear this. You know, and you know, knock on knock on my door, and I'm like. And I'm not answering. I, I'm like, well, maybe they, I just pretend I'm not here. And and they knock, they knock, they knock, knock. And they're saying if he, it's 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 his name's Joe, the senior referee. His name is Joe. He kind of kind of organized, run a lot of the stuff. And I'm like, man, I am. I know what it's about. I'm just I'm just gonna blow it off. So I get to the arena that night, and they're like, Nikita, Joe, 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 I want to talk to you. You know, and I'm like. So I go and talk to Joe and a couple of the guys are like, last night, no good, no good. You tear up bar, Terry Gordy, you tear up Gordy, tear I go, and I just look at him, I go, I, um, no. I go, I didn't even have a drink. I go, I didn't tear up any bar. I got Terry out of the bar and got him back to his hotel before more damage was done and more people were embarrassed and he did more things to embarrass himself. They're like, you pay, you pay, you pay half, half damage, half damage. And I'm like, no, dude, I'm like, I'm not, no, I'm not paying no damage. I got, just, no, uh-uh. Well, they, they, they were not happy about that at all. The fact that I wouldn't pay, pay half the damages. He, Terry had made tons of tours over there and made tons of tours over there after that which is crazy too. But I guess I fell out of their good graces because I wouldn't kick in for, for half of the damages. But it was just, I just, I didn't do it. So I didn't feel right about doing it. So yeah, it was, it was crazy. And because of that, um, they, never, they never invited me back for any more tours.